Hello and welcome back to another First Down Impressions. We've got a lot for you today and we're starting off with Star Renegades. Uh, the music is very loud so I'm going to have to get straight into this one I think. Ooh, there we go. Options. Um, audio. So we're going to turn the max down. Oh, that's better. I'm going to turn it down to... Let's just... Some, well, 50 might be alright. 50%. So what does it go down to? Yeah, it goes right down to 30. Okay, so we'll start off with 15. Uh, and that's about it. So, um, before we do anything else, graphics, we're going to have a screen shake on this default, I suppose. Toggle shadows. We'll keep them on. Post processing, we'll keep that on. And fast forward uh, effect. Ooh, I don't know what that means, so <laughs> we'll find out, I suppose, as we go on. <clears throat> Auto fast forward in. Hmm. That's off. Oh, fast forward in combat. Uh, fast forward speed times four. Always run on map. Do you know what? I think I'm going to have that answer to yes because. No, we'll, we'll keep it off. We can always go, come back actually. See what it's like at walking speed. Instant camping. Animations. Suppress idle banter. Well, we're going to keep that all the same. Just seeing that one. And the language. We have quite a few options. Um. We are in the UK, so we're going to be uh, in English, obviously. So let's go straight into the game. So as you can see, I've not even, I don't even know actually what kind of uh, game this is, to be honest. Uh, I'm expecting RPG, roguelike, don't know why. So yeah, as you can see, I haven't uh, put any hours into it. Oh, that's quite cool. And I will press play on my hour timer once I have control of my characters. Wagwan! Alright, so it's telling a story without words. Okay, cool. Invading ship. We're all happy to invade. And they're not very happy about us being here. <laughs> Whoa! Only survivor? Okay. Yep. This is all very um, Star Wars right now. <laughs> Star Wars, Star Trek. Do, 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 do. And. So this is an SSD, and if this is the loading time so far... Hmm. Okay, over Norris. A small force of mysterious raiders destroy the mighty Star Union Armada. The surviving starfighters attempt to regroup, pursued by the relentless enemy squadrons. Uh, whoa, this is cool! This looks so cool! Okay. Win, answer me. Let me know you're alive. I'm fine, Dav. Those enemy fighters are good, real good. I'm lucky I managed to land in one piece. You get points for missing all those buildings. Oh, zub zub grunt. <laughs> what the fudge? <laughs> I've got more of those fighters on my tail. <laughs> Where are they all coming from? I landed the train. I landed by the train in Fort Garon. If I can get to the base in time, you can get those antique aircraft guns online. My thoughts exactly. That'll be a nice surprise for these fighters following me. Great plan. I'll comm you when I'm at the base. Over and out. Oh, I just love this whole like 3D effect thing. This is so cool. Okay, what have we got here? Inspect. So, not the best use of taxpayer credits. Hmm, correct. I'm assuming I'm supposed to go towards that uh, that thing that's flashing at the top there. This is so cool. Oh, here's her. Citizen. Oh, sure. The government tells us some mysterious fleet just appears out of nowhere. Next thing you know, they they pass some laws confiscating massive stockpiles of mega nuclear material, even though it's my right to own it. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. Anything around here? No. All right, we'll just go straight towards whatever flashing thing is. Oh no, we won't. I just oh spotted some people. Quite difficult to see, but yeah. Citizen, you know what? Sure, these raiders from another dimension just destroyed our armada, but. 
I thought he was about to say the same thing as the other person. Uh, but I think we should hear out what they plan to do post-occupation. Maybe they're into low taxes and grinding the poor into dust. <laughs> That's some policy I could get behind. <laughs> uh, huh? Who thought the Narosh would be close to a fight like this? And right before tourist season, also, <laughs> I'll be ruined. Fair enough. I can see that there's going to be a lot of uh, fun uh, uh, citizen chat going on. Thank you for your service, ma'am. But could you please send someone to clear that smoking wreckage? We have children here. Of course. Use train. I'm picking up some strange signatures on that train. Something tells me that they aren't commu commuters. I'm assuming this is going to be the uh, tutorial battle. These raiders are groups of ground troops too, then, huh? Here we go. All right. So let's see how they are hand-to-hand -hand combat. Looks like there's a timeline at the top. Prepare to meet my... Prepare to meet my doom. I think he meant your doom. However, this will be my... This will be a cinch. Take him out with a cleave. So combat in Star Renegades is deterministic, meaning that you can see your enemy's actions before they execute, allowing you to defend, crit, stagger, or break them. All actions are displayed on the timeline according to their execution time in the round, except for instant actions where, which execute immediately. Each round is 60 seconds. So, okay, one of the, my favorite battle uh, mechanics is in um, uh, Grandia, and I just, I've always wanted to, more games to embrace it, so I'm hoping this is going to be sort of similar. So, combat basic stats and actions. A unit's current health is shown in the status bar above their head and consists of shields, health and armour. Any effects are also displayed above the status bar. On enemies you can see the action they are going to take or going to execute. Okay. Shields regenerate at the end of every combat. Armour can only be damaged after shields are depleted. Health and armour can be healed or repaired during campaign, during campaign or from health kits and armour stations found during your mission. Alright, so circle is dismissed. So some will be permanent, some won't be. So go down to Cleave. That puts me quite far. I'm going to attack you. What? Okay. He may be dumb, but I should probably hit him before he hits me. I'll recalibrate and crit him with a slash. Okay, a crit occurs when a unit hits before they can execute their action. The crit bonus is applied, that is applied is shown below, attacking the power's main formation. So crit, slash more crit bonus is the pink, red-ish. Uh, crits can do extra damage, break the enemy's attack, pierce shields or armor, damage arm or have other devastating effects. Be careful though, enemies can also crit your heroes if they are hit before they can execute their attack. Okay, so so slash. It's got a crit. Shields down. Been critted. Uh, that got his attention. I'll smash him with a, a hue to break him, and he'll stall his attack. There's a lot of stuff being thrown at me straight off. Um, attacks can stagger uh, an enemy's action, delaying its delaying it to execute later in the round allowing you to your squad to execute more actions and crit and crits before they uh, enemy can attack or act the amount of stagger an enemy can do when crit is shown is in green beside the stagger time delay icon so 20 seconds the attacks can stagger an enemy all right with careful planning you can chain attacks together and land multiple staggers on an enemy and break them by pushing them into the next round. However, an enemies enemies have a stagger limit, denoting how many times they can be staggered. Oh, I've heard about this one. You can I can, you can stagger them twice, maybe, before they are immune. This is shown in the timeline beside their portrait. An enemy stagger limit increases again after they execute their action. Enemies cannot be staggered beyond the end of their next round. So uh, applies to crit effect bleeding. So if I can crit, I can. Uh, break here. Oh, so the timeline is to the left, not to the right. Sorry, I was I was looking at it as as though 
Uh, the end of the timeline was on the right, but it's not. It's on the left. So that's time to end. So slash should do the job. Okay. So slash that will be me next. It will crit him. It will knock him back. The timeline. Such a weird thing for the timeline to move from right to left. But I kind of get it. Okay, so I've got two credits. That's a victory. Which I'm assuming is scripted. Okay, I'm at the base. Uh, just what I thought. It's been hit with some kind of EMP. Well, at least the coast is... Not clear. Oh, no. Teleported in. Union techs have been researching that. For decades, how do these guys do it? They may be more advanced than us, but at least we can take them out in a fight. Let's see how I can do against this next one. Just remember your training and you'll be fine. Question mark, what is this? Titan hand? Well, I guess the earth shifted enough to expose one of these titan hands. There's loads of them. There's one up here as well. Is this a titan head? Titan... There's robots everywhere! Okay. Um, so I can attack. Oh! So it's automatic. So if I can see an enemy, I can just press the X button. And it'll get towards. Let's see what I've learned, shall we? Imperium... The Imperium will make you burn. Okay. Sounds like you could use some ointment for that. <laughs> now let's try a cleave. Uh, okay, so that'll knock him back. Resist versus heavy. Okay. Well, I've crit though. <laughs> Oof. Oof. Whoops, that didn't work. Yeah, I can see that. Maybe a <laughs> lighter touch. Let's try Hugh. Uh, all attacks have a core damage type that describes what kind of attack it is. They are light, normal, heavy, flurry, AoE, counter, and combo attacks. Okay, heavy cleave, light 20. Okay, so it's weak versus uh, Hugh. Uh, adversaries may be weak to a specific core damage types and take extra damage and delays from them. However, they can also be resistant or even immune to specific core damage types and take little to no damage and delays from them. So it's going to knock him back again. He's going to try to immolate again. That's two knockbacks. He's been broken, right? So he's missed his go. That's better. Now smash him for another break. Slash. Shields down and weak. Okay. He's going to miss his go. His break limit is empty, so so much for delaying him. I'll have to defend to minimize the damage from his flame attack. He just laugh. <laughs> so I'll defend. So what am I going to take? 50%? Hmm, let, about that. Okay, pal, I'm getting sick of you. Let's try and crack your armor with Sunder. Armor absorbs damage before it reaches health. The amount of damage that can be absorbed per hit is equal to the amount of armor they have. Okay. Example. Attack damage 56. Shield damage 8. Yeah, okay. So enemy armor. Attacks that can you cause uh, armor damage on a crit. Display the amount of armor damage that can be done. This is so much information, man. Uh, some attacks or elemental damage types can pierce armor. While it doesn't damage the armor, it can bypass some of it and damage enemy's health directly. I think I'll only ever learn it once I get straight into this. So, I sunder. The crit bonus. Okay. broken his armor so he's missed and he's gone back his armor's completely broken now's the time to finish off I'll crit him with a slash so crit kabloom 
Okay, five credits. Yeah, I could use those guns about that now. I've got a trail of fighters right behind me. Roger that. Yeesh. A little sis to the rescue, I guess. So is that where I'm going, huh? What does that mean? Oh, it just means I have to use it to cross the... Uh... Oh, so circle is run. Yeah, that's quite fast. This is... I think the speed's normal. It's fine. Uh, I'm assuming that would be there to cross that path. Fort Garrison. Oh, Fort Garrison, sorry. Saw that... Uh, Fort Garrison saw a lot of action in the Flux Wars, but now it's mostly used for training. They have a flag. Okie dokie. Banner. Terminal. Okay, Dev. The guns are powered up. I'll lead these fighters right to you. It'll be like shooting zub zubs in a barrel. Uh oh. Um, where'd that ominous otherworldly ship come from? I've got a bad feeling. Hmm. Davian, pull up. Something else took remote control of the guns. What? Oh, wait. She could be my number two. Uh, I guess I botched the landing. Yeah, my upload speed isn't great at the moment. I apologise, it's the best I can do. Uh, I guess I botched the landing. Dav, you're alive. We've got to get out there. Can we walk? I'm fine, just a little shaken. That was a close call. Basilisk. I found what you're looking for, Mother. He's as pathetic as you said he'd be. Battle, bitch. Your life, it is nothing. Sounds <laughs> kind of sounds like dad, right? Got seven armor on this baby. Uh, not the time for jokes, Win. Remember, find his weakness and exploit it again and again. Hmm, maybe I'm sounding like dad now. Okay, it'll use inspection mode a view, to view a unit's stats and who they are targeting. Okay, while in inspection mode, you can also view a unit's traits and effects to see what weaknesses, strengths, resistance and immunities they have. Uh, when targeting an enemy, you are shown a, uh, a prediction of the outcomes of your actions on the enemies for that round. If your actions are, if your actions will presumably result in the death of an enemy, then a kill shot indicator will be displayed. A late kill indicates, indicator means that the enemy will execute their action before dying. Okay, important. Damage predictions and the kill shot indicators are not always 100% accurate because m many things, heals, damage, debuffs, defense buffs, can happen before the final blow lands, resulting in a change of outcome. So, what was the. So, you got a blade throw? Flurry. What was the. Um... Oh, R2. Okay, laser eyes. Irradiated. Def uh, plus five defense versus health. Health damage blocked by shields uh, and armor. Critical bonus nineteen traits. Shield. Mm -mm -mm. I don't understand what is this irradiated. What is it weak to? I can't see what it's weak to. Um, it's going to attack this person here so blade throw siphon stab did it say it was weak to heavy no doesn't does it oh 100% uh, 125% damage versus laser so if I give it a laser that's what it's going to do Right, so can I just damage something like for 2 times 40, vivisect, heavy, 
That's multiple people, that's individual. Hmm. Well, this person I want to defend, I think. Oh, if I do that, it can crit. Let's cleave. With this person, I can cleave. I'm going to cleave, and this person is going to... Weak versus heavy. So that's the that's the heavy one, I assume. So the laser eyes are gonna be next. When remember that combo attack we used to practice? The one we broke Dad's grav hopper window doing. That's the one. Now's a good time to try out. So we're going to show me com uh, combined attacks. Okay, good idea. Just make sure we we generated enough fury first. So your heroes generate fury by landing crits and breaks on the enemy. Crits generate one fury worth breaks. Generally generate three. Use fury to execute special actions or combo maneuvers for devastating effect. Combos are special maneuvers that cost fury and are executed by two of your heroes simultaneously. Each combo can only be executed once per combat. Combos are only available for heroes that have strong relationships which can be increased during campaign. Okay, so that's, I'm assuming this is the combo. No, maybe not. So I need to knock him back. I can knock him back three times. So Hugh can be knocked back. It's weak to, th to... It's just... Is that strong though? Oh no, there it is. AoE, flurry, AoE, heavy. Okay, so the heavy's going to be pretty much the same. Um, can I knock him back? They're both going to be heavy. Let's just try a heavy at the same time. And then you can defend. That was a pretty nifty... What the fudge? Uh, I have a feeling I'm going to lose this fight. So he's charging, so if I can do heavies twice, give a sec, and then another heavy. Assuming that will work. Two heavies in a row. Temporary setback, mother shall soon have her victory. What? Tell me I'm, I'm supposed to lose here. Um, stay back, win, and I'll take care of this guy. What he lacks in charisma, he makes up for her hideousness. <laughs> Mysterious figure, mother only wants you, Davion Syphex. She has no interest in the female. Did I just say incested? Okay, uh, no way you're doing this solo, Dev. We need to work together to defeat him. So he's got 44 shield! Hmm, okay. So let's have a look on the right. Let's have a look. This person here is 25% versus marked, so whatever that means. Crit bonus, 16 times 3, Jesus. Look at that health! How am I going to get that health down? What, what, 1984? <laughs> Alright, so... Uh, yeah, okay, well, let's just see what kind of like attacks I can do, I suppose. 
heavy, won't do anything. That won't do anything. Now, if I can, cr well, hang on, that can crit. That can crit. No, that will crit too much. That would be the same. So a flurry can crit, probably hit at the same time, but siphon stab, that can probably do nicely. Uh, this won't knock him back all the way, will it? Oh, maybe it will. That'll break him. The hue will break him. And then... Right, so let's break him. Applies critical effect bleeding. Alright. Let's try that, shall we? Yeah, bleed, bitch. So that's given me four... Fury points. So I'm assuming. Oh, I, I just have a feeling this is going to take a lot of. Oh, he's going to come very. Ooh, no, he's going to have to defend. Defend. And you can. Let's just defend also. Enough, this is taking far too long and results are inevitable. Dave, get back, be careful. Quantum burst? What does the quantum burst do? What? Jesus, look, so okay, so that's 13, 39. Uh, cannot be delayed. Looks like this person's gonna absolutely need to get nailed. Uh, late kill? Uh oh. So. Ugh. What does that mean? What does the Psyfix stand mean? That's the... Come, both of us. Bleeding applies critical effect. It's a combo. I don't like that. Kill shot. Late kill, kill shot, kill sh Late kill, late kill. What does kill shot mean here? Ugh, I need to rewatch my own trade. Okay, so kill shot, late kill. I want to try a kill shot here. Because it's a heavy, and it's on the same as theirs. Let's just try that. Um, see, none of these can be can delay it. No, let's go for Cyphic Slam. Fuck it. C -c -c Combo Breaker! Maker, even. That was the trophy! And now this person's gonna get nailed, everyone's gonna die. I'm assuming that's scripted. It's got to be. No, this can't be happening. Mother, I have done what you asked. Bring me back. I cannot mass last much longer. So they retreated. Kill shot is that the unit will die before making a move. Oh, I see. Uh, Dav, come on, get up, please. I can't do this without you. The Imperium Throne Room. The Throne Room is where you can view details in the Imperium Hierarchy and all the current known leaders, behemoths, and adversaries. Adversaries. <laughs> adversaries. Um, from time to time, 
you will be brought here to witness events such as deaths, promotions, inductions, sorry, introductions within the Imperium. You can also access the Imperium throne room directly from the main menu. Adversaries are the elite soldiers from the Imperium. They are stronger, tougher, and have unique special traits and abilities. They also have unique personalities, so no adv two adversaries are ever the same. Adversaries can also be promoted, evolve, grow stronger whenever they are able to defeat you. Adversaries are usually guarding a rare or epic reward crate. Okay! Whoa, what? I'm targeting here. So I can speak to the Overseer, I suppose, and I can talk to these things. Lieutenants. Okay, interesting. <laughs> uh, no, I don't think they did. Uh, I'm going to speak to the Overseer here. Or can I not? Oh, I can't target it, so I'm assuming... Can I... Oh, hang on. It's this one. It's only if they're highlighted. Herald. Omega Herald. Uh, 595 health. Quite a lot of strength. 50% 50, 50 defense versus staggers. Nothing. Immune to nothing. But that's just strength. Okay. Okay, I'm going to exit here. Meanwhile, elsewhere. Hmm. Load! <laughs> Come on! I'm liking it. It's oof, it's a lot thrown at me, so... Oh, I've got to press the button. There's no loading. <laughs> i got to be sat there for the next 30 minutes. There, I found them. Uh, that's where the Imperium have invaded next. They must have already started their attack. Alright, the only thing left to do is to turn you on. Whee. Okay, what is this? So, activate droid. Beautiful. All systems go. Maybe this fight isn't over after all. I did a pretty good job of making you look like you run of the mill server bot. That should come in handy. Now, Justin. <laughs> we have to go outside. I'll let you lead the way. All I've got to do is just make it out. Am I controlling the bot? I am controlling the bot. Speed run. Nothing here is gonna. I'm assuming I can't like speak to stuff unless it's got like a marker on it or if it's a human. Press X to go through doors. Oh, I can view squad, but I can't because the square button doesn't work right now. Uh, okay. Leave the bunker. Whoa. These buildings usually aren't on fire. Uh, the attack just ended, but they'll be back soon to finish the job. So we have to hurry. The entry point is right over there. Assuming there's nothing around me that I can see that I can pick up. Pay attention, J5. You need to walk through this portal and deliver a very important message for me. Professor Zurek, find him. They're the only person I can trust. They might be a little testy, but that's just how geniuses are sometimes. Find them and play the message I gave you. Can you do that? Mm. I'll take that as a yes. Countless lives depend on you doing that. Though try not to let that give you a big, a big head. Or sphere, I suppose. Go through the portal when you're ready. Mm. What's that? Don't worry about me. <laughs> Your mission is the only thing that matters anymore. Okie dokie. Okay, here we go. Let's hope this world... Oh, let's hope this works. <laughs> he made it good now. There's hoping... Here's hoping he can. Kerblam! There you are. Well, what were you waiting for? You've got me, haven't you? Uh, have I just gone back in time? Many of you have just told me what Davion meant to you. For that, I thank you. I only wish Davion were here so I could tell him directly. Thank you, Moin. <laughs> Look at that arm. <laughs> uh, a moment of silence for our fallen warrior, please. Can 
Can I speak to it? No, I can't speak to you. Now, on to business at hand. Some of you have approached me wondering what that council plans to do with, this, with these raiders. The ones that destroyed the armada and killed Colonel Syphex. And as a member of that joint chiefs, as a member of the joint chiefs, <laughs> let me just say we have a plan. We will rebuild the armada stronger than ever and we'll send that vessel back to the hell it came from. How long does he think this is going to take? Sure, let's, let's build something real quickly. In five minutes. Oh, there it is, built. It's not Lego. What did I say about not being... Sai, come here. Give me whatever professor uh, message you have. It's her. From the past. I'm in the middle of studying the most important and explainable quantum phenomenon of my career. So wherever this is, I hope it's reality shattering. Hello, Dr. Jurek. Oh, I guess that counts. Let's cut to the chase. I'm you, and you're me. We're from distant realities. I know this is highly confusing, even to you. I've sent this hyper-advanced servo bot across the quantum divide to warn you. Your reality is under attack, even as we speak. Does this have anything to do with the Q71 entanglement phenomenon you detected over the Narash? Precisely. You certainly alerted the Star Union Council, and they've dispatched Yamada to investigate. You'll learn very soon that the Amada has been destroyed by a starship of an unimaginable power cloaked in the entanglement. This ship is from another reality, and its goal is to conquer your entire galaxy. I know, because they've already conquered mine. I've got to warn them, it's far too late. But when the Council calls, seeking your brilliant expertise on para parallel realities, you'll need to have a plan ready. That's where I come in. I know these invaders next move. And you can stop. And now you can. St and how you can stop them? If you follow my lead, your world has a shot. But if you fail, promise me you'll send Justin through the next reality they invade, because they will never stop. Now listen up. Here's the plan. The first step is to, is this: reach out to General Geddon and play him this message. You'll need to explain it to him. <sighs> but it'll help you. But. He'll help you form the kind of task force necessary to bring this invasion down. Trophy! Revenge motivation acquired. This is a hell of a long intro. Okay, so we are select. We're here. These are all locked. Can't select a moon, so. Beer moths are present, apparently. Is it just going to be me? Raffi. What do you need me to do, mother? Kill them all? Alright, that seems reasonable. So. I can't choose anything else, so. Enraged when hit with pulse damage. 50% uh, defense versus normal. Weak versus pyro. Weak versus corruption damage. 50% def uh, defense versus minus 50% versus corruption. Okay, so pyro and corruption is weak to 50% defense against normal and enrage when hit with pulse damage. So can I take him on? Let's take him on. No, I can't. No, okay, maybe not. I'm assuming these are just people that I'll end up sort of fighting throughout the game like random fights and whatnot what are these oh it's me sorry about that the engineers said the landing would be smoother I've gone through worse landing so, uh, Stanley as long as you get just in survival as long as you and Justin survived, it's a success, success in my book. Zzz, you should help your companions with their pods. It seems they're having a little trouble with the hatches. Come on. On it. Come on, Justin. Help me out. There we go. Who have we got? Zura and Zura. And RZA. How was the trip? 
Oh, praise Lord Buta for delivering us safely to this battlefield. Butola, you mean. Oh yeah, Titans be praised, etc, etc, etc. Get it, I get it. Look, you're not going to try and convert me again, are you? Um, is he religious? Nodo Cathoris. Now, this is the problem I have with most games which have names that are impossibly difficult to pronounce and that I'm not familiar with. I'm going to get it wrong and the first pronunciation that I have with it, that in my head, I'm going to stick with it. <laughs> so, Nodo Calthoris. That's your name. Okay. Uh, I'm locked and loaded and ready to roll out. Let's smoke these bogeys. Win Cyphex. What are you doing? Just take it, talking like a space marine. Don't like it? I can switch to Nodo Normal Star. Yeah, why don't you just do that? No problemo. Normal it is, boy. -o. Enough chit chat. Move out and take control of that Imperium base. Kill anything that slows you down. Don't get cocky though. One of you, one of their elite officers will be stationed at the base and you'll have to go through him. I suppose that's the person we've just seen. Uh, we'll be in contact to provide permission specs along the way. Now lock and load, boyos. Time to tag and bag some Imperium drones. Now roll out. See, I told you that that's how Space Marines talk. My spiritual teachings tell me that both paths are favoured uh, for our objective. The wisdom clearly knows no bounds. Psst, boss lady. Just so you know, these fundamentalists aren't big on sarcasm. This is true. <laughs> we preach a radical form of dishonest discourse, of honest discourse, devoid of exaggeration of any form or subtlety. No, that was a demonstration of sarcasm to you, idiot human. Am I? No, not bad. Of course we're going to go the opposite way. We want to see what's down here. Bridge is out. So it's a level one. Mm, let's try it. Let's take you on, boyo. Oh, now I'm speaking like them. Oh, there's two of them. So, I can slash, I can cleave, but it won't, uh, I would, yeah, so let's slash. Alright, who are you going to attack first? You're going to attack me. You're both going to attack me. Auto fire, laser blast. So, auto fire is going to do 3 times 17, that's going to tell you the most. So let's take you out first. Um, discharge. Bestow shields. So it can give us shields? Give you shields. Don't know why I'm do that, but fudge it. So he can do a straight shot. Uh, reduce defense now. Now, like these are. So that one's got two armor on it. This one hasn't, but it's stronger. Okay, well, let's. Uh, can break him when it goes back. Okay, here we go. So it's got a crit on him. Shields down. He's broken, so he won't be able to attack. And of course, the shields have run a bit late. Should have really paid attention to that. So, this guy. I have a feeling I'm going to need to. Hang on, have I been given shields? No, I haven't. Can I be defuffed? Ugh. Right, can I attack? Uh, let's see what this person can do first. So straight shot, can I kill him first? No, it's going to be after, isn't it? That's going to crit. They're both still going to attack me. Well, I'm going to re attack you there. Oh, no, hang on. Why did he attack straight away?
I want to cleave. My shields are showing it as being quite high at the moment. Alright. Oh, the other one was just to give me more shields. Fair enough. It wasn't to, to give me extra. Um... Charge. Let's discharge you and then Okay, go for that. shields onto my lady and you can do let's that's gonna be a kill shot that's pretty cool <laughs> This is going to crit you, so yeah. DNA plus Vol. Sorry, but I'm going to need you to end your. I'm going to need you to end your lives now. Rules, rules. What? 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 So I can't go back that way. What the? Okay, expect. So anyone else freaked out by these giant hands? In the end, it's just a hand, but it's a really, really old hand. I know a few collectors who'd pay a top dollar for a Titan hand like this. I'm sure you would. So if you look at my health, it is back to being like full again, which is nice. DNA, what does this mean? Gain DNA. Level up. Ooh, square. Okay, so... Level up. Here we go. When you've obtained enough DNA, you can use it to level up your heroes. Levels are reset when you return to the Renegade base and jump to the next dimension. Okay. Use DNA to decide who you want to level up. Leveling up would increase health damage and possibly grant a new power or camping card. Potential new powers or cards are displayed in the Heroes Details panel. Okay, so uh, I've got uh, I've got eight DNA. This would cost six, five, and six. So this will give me plus thirty health so far. Gains taunts enemy, so I wouldn't mind a tank. Titan strength, or can it only be executed once per combat a trick shot. Right, we're going to have a tank, I think. So, let's just do that. So, we're going to build towards that, I think. That might be his. Oh, hello. So, resume game. Formation. Formation. Front line. Back line. Cool. Okay. This is my back line. This is my front line. Do you know what? Can I move him there? Or has he been defended by that one? Yes, because he's got no... No, it's the robot that's got no shield. Okay, Imperium. Tutorial scorecards, options, abandon mission, save and exit. Okay, cool. Uh, yeah, we've been down there, haven't we? Let's go! Take on this Mother Hubbard. Shields steal? What? Uh, okay, so... If I slash, I can take that one back there, and I can take that one back there. So this one will go back further. So I'm going to knock him back further on the timeline, I think, because he's first. Um, 
Oof, discharge, I can crit both of them. And then this blitz shot can break him. It can break you as well. And it can break you, okay. Let's do that. Okay, that's my tank. Cluster bomb. So the shield steel is still out there. So if I was a battle cry, inspired, that's fifty percent damage. No, let's not do that. Start, uh, let's start with. That cleave is too far down that line. He can't be knocked backwards though. Oh, it's a kill shot. Yeah, let's go for the kill shot because I don't want to cluster bomb. Discharge. Why does that bring him forward? Shield bot. Da, 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 da. Stow shields. Let's let's just give this person the shields again, and then straight shot. It's not gonna knock you because it won't knock you back. Alrighty, that's why. Uh, let's. Let's do it anyway. Kill shot, bitch! So it's stolen the shields, however, it's just given me shields. Sweet. It's just gonna steal shields, isn't it, the whole time? Uh, okay, so if I can go for a battle cry against this one. And now it's now taunted, so it's going to go for me. Can I slash it back the timeline? Can I discharge? I still don't understand why that does. Okay, and straight shot, kill shot. All right, here we go. Shields right down, and then straight shot is good old crit. Nice. 60 and A, level up. So let's level up. Um can gain titan strength or you know this guy here no I think I don't want to lose this guy so I'm going to give it to him oh hang on what powers strength whatever that is hang on what have I just done here so level up oh I see that was just a I pressed the wrong button Plus 11 health, new power. Okay, cool. Crystal. Uh, I've heard that these crystals are made from the droppings of the titans. <laughs> okay. My third eye is still closed. I guess this crystal's broken. How much do you think this thing would go for in the black market? Hypothetically. Uh, I'm assuming this is a door that's shut. And maybe not. Uh... Just to make sure... No, there's nothing down here. Cool. Shields? What does that mean? Gain shields. Well, we've got shields, but let's see what it does anyway. Which shields would you like to improve? Ooh! Valkyrie, Archon, Saboteur. Um, well, Valkyrie, really, because I'm the, I'm the one that's taking... 
just want to make sure that is me. I am the Valkyrie, yeah. Because I'm the one that's taking all the hits. I am being the tank right now. Imperial defences. Impressive bit of machinery. Looks like they aren't online though. I wouldn't want to be in the business of the... of. I wouldn't really like to be on the business end of this baby. Sometimes a big gun is just a big gun. Alright, as soon as I go through I'm fighting... I'm fighting the... Uh, compulsive rules follower, <laughs> Menku Lieutenant. Okay, here we go. This is the one that's in the... In the place... Uh, I can't remember what it's called now. Uh, I'm sure it, sorry, but I'm going to need to end your lives now at Rules of Rules. Did he keep... It's the second time he said that. He's on Overwatch. So that means anything... Anything I do, he's going to just try and nail me for. Right? Uh, uh, so if I go to try and... Yeah. He's going to attack. So he's resistant versus normal, and but not versus heavy. What does this guy can this guy do to here? Hmm. If I can take him out first, let's go for that straight shot. I see. Hold all. If you press the circle, you can cancel all your your moves, and that's quite quite like that. So straight shot is a normal light. So can that knock him back as well? That doesn't knock him back at all, but straight shot. It's a crit. But it's resist. So no, I don't really want to do that. What would I do here? Return. So he's going to return fire there. Hmm. Um... Discharge, it's going to return fire no matter what. Bestow shields. So let's just go back to you. Now, I'm going to cleave, I think. Cleave you. This person, I'm going to bestow shields. Oh, hang on, what? Right, so he's going to attack that guy. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to bestow shields back on myself. Um, and I'm going to give that one to the Overwatch guy. I want to see what this does. Shields are down already? So he's crit me with my shields there. Can take him out. Broken his armor. He's healed himself. Back to normal shields. Uh, might makes right. So he's going to just fire and the other one's going to do a direct strike. So they're both attacking me right now. So if I can cleave, uh, fortunately, that will be... No, that's not enough. I think I just need them to, to, to just defend. Right, you're going to defend. This one is going to discharge... Uh, before I do, what does a blitz do here? Yeah, okay, I'm gonna knock you right back, break you. Reduced defences, so if I can discharge here, it's going to crit again, but not kill. I'm going to just give you full shields. Man, 
17. And he's going to fire again. Uh, slash? Resistance versus normal. This is going to be a battle of attrition, isn't it, really? So I can do a blitz shot. Reduce defense. He can't be reduced backwards, but this one can. So let's reduce you back. Um. That's going to be a kill shot. attack you. Okay, so I'm going to bestow shields onto you again. Give me back my shields! Danke. Nice crit. See ya! Reduced damage. Yeah, I bet you didn't even know what there, bet you don't even know what to do with yourself now. I've got you covered. So, if I'm concussed, does that mean... It's going to knock him back, but... That would knock him back a little bit further, but... I don't... Oh, who will attack me first? So, straight shot. It would knock back a little bit. Blitz break you juice defenses cleave let's break you quite a lot and then let's give you Titan strength Oh, two kill shots. Let's see how we get on. Oh, that's one kill shot. But that is superb. Ah, <laughs> what a guess. Lieutenant Liquidator. So I've got 11 DNA and one intel. Ooh, what does that mean? Dynamic duo. Woo. Camping card reward. So uh, defeat adversary lieutenant together. Exhaust when used. Stash. Nice. So, I was just following orders. <laughs> Defeat it, motherfucker. I am slowly getting the hang of this uh, combat. Uh, a gift from the Titans to help us cleanse the Holy Land of the health, uh, Heathen Imperium. So, before I do... That is my timer. So, that's been an hour. Um, quite quite a lot to go through um, so my first impression it's got a lot to it um, it's probably one of those games that it'll throw a lot of information at you but just when you start playing it you'll understand what things can do just play around with a few things and I'm assuming it's a roguelike so if you die early you can continue again and you just just take what you learn um, uh, I'm gonna open this crate just to see what it actually gives me so does it, can I, do I choose one of these? Oh, it does. So choose one. I can choose the. Uh, I can choose a vest plus three armor. Particle blade plus ten all attacks or normal damage. Reaver chip. I quite like the idea of having a. Oh, so it depends on who it can be equipped by. So, all right, um, that can be equipped by everyone. That can be equipped by. Just myself and that could be it so I'll, I'll probably go for defense if i'm honest uh yeah i'll probably choose this one so let's equip press square to equip it impressive technology yet a curse nonetheless imperium tech is more advanced than ours in every way so feel free to steal anything you can i would mind i wouldn't mind the opportunity to analyze it the imperium just um it must have a huge r d budget 
and yet the actual Imperium soldiers are monumentally stupid. What gives? <laughs> My best guess is that the cross-quantum journey takes a toll on brain functions. This will explain why they're networked to the advanced AI Neuronet. Although it's uh, anyone's guess why they re refer to this AI as Mother. So what you're telling us is that we're facing an army of mindless, psychotic drone soldiers with mummy issues. Um, let me just see what I can do here. Hey, you know what? It just reminds me of. I just realised. This reminds me of um, uh, Mario vs. Rabbids when you've got like the, the puck. <laughs> just <laughs> follows everyone around. It's quite cool. I'm just going to level up here again. So this one's going to give me a Siphon, Siphonex Wit. What is that? Uh, attacks cause bleeding, critical damage, last two combats. Nice. Or do I give it to this one? What does this mean? Preach. Armor piercing, last two combats. Nice. Um, I'm going to do it, give it to this guy. So yeah. There we go. We're all plus two there now. So weird. All right, we'll come out of this. So yeah, um, let me just pause it here. I love the art style to start off with. This is not going to be a game for beginners. Um, if you're used to this kind of game, you'll probably love it. I love the music. It's really quite atmospheric. It's quite talky though. Sometimes that puts me off these kind of games. I just want to just get through them. Like uh, like Slay the Spire. It's just very much like you know visual plays you learn. However, um, there's probably a good story in here. So you know. It uh, swings of roundabouts, I hope, I, I suppose. Uh, is it a recommendation? Yes, it is a recommendation. Uh, I think I think anyone who plays this will will appreciate at least one one of those things I've mentioned before that I quite like. Uh, yeah, we'll see. Uh, we'll see. The, the, the weakest point, uh, the weakest bit about this game I can probably see is probably the story, because if you're going to be going through, it's a roguelike and you're going through it again and again, you might be like a bit tired of what uh, what the story can offer you. However, uh, I hear the runs are quite long. It's not like you know ten minute runs or stuff. It's, it could be hours or a couple of hours. You know what I mean? So anyway, right from here, I will save and exit because I'm going to do some more one HIs. But uh, let's see how it saves my progression and see how long we've actually spent in game here. So press X to start, play. So I've done an hour and five minutes. Not bad. Okay. All right. Well, thanks very much for watching, guys. Um, I appreciate your time. Uh, I hope you have a good day. Thank you.